setting up my consultancy, I guess, was a bit of an itch I'd wanted to scratch for a while. So it's something that had been mulling around in my head while I was in the corporate world. And I'd been in the corporate world for over 30 years in a number of different industry sectors, um, predominantly in an HR role. So the first question really was, why am I doing it? Um, and for me, the reason I was doing it um, was reasonably clear, I thought, but actually that's evolved um, as I've started. So go on, to, what was it initially and then how it evolved? Yeah, so initially it was, I want to have more freedom, I want to have more flexibility, I want to do the sort of work that, that, I, want to work, that, mm. that I want to do and leave the bits of the, the job behind that I didn't enjoy as much. Mm. Um, and I want to make a real difference um, in organisations. That's all fine and that's, that's still very, very true. But what I wasn't, was I wasn't focused enough about specifically what sort of work, what sort of organisations and what sort of difference I wanted to make. Mm -hmm. And that has become clearer for me as, as my business has developed. So... It's an interesting question for me to ask, should I have done that and be clear about it right at the start? For me, I'm not sure I could have done. I think I needed to put my toe in the water and I'm now ready to get the advice and the support I need to think about how I take it to the next stage. Definitely things that I've done well and things that I haven't done so well <laughs> along the way. Um, and I think what I'm proud of in terms of what I've done is I just went out there and gave it a go. I took the plunge um, and I was willing to be really flexible um, and, 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 and give things a try. So I'm really proud of that and I've, I've done really well in my first couple of years. What I would do differently is I, is I would have thought a bit more carefully about what type of business I wanted and therefore where to go and get it. So I think I had that typical anxiety when you first start off on your own about, can I do this? Am I going to make it a success? So almost any type of work felt great. Um, and I've, I've, I've done some great work. I've, I've re really busy. But in the early stages, I probably spent a lot of time networking in smaller smaller organizations where really my target market is is bigger corporates i'm an executive coach i do um systemic team coaching with senior executive teams so it's it's larger corporates that really i needed to be networked with rather than the small businesses which were a bit safer and easier to begin with <laughs> but probably not where i really needed to be some great tips and experience there, Anne. Thank you very much indeed. And good luck for the next stage of your you. business development here. Good luck.